What is climate change? Climate change refers to long-term shifts in temperatures and weather patterns. Such shifts can be natural, due to changes in the sun's activity or large volcanic eruptions. But since the 1800s, human activities have been the main driver of climate change, primarily due to the burning of fossil fuels like coal, oil and gas. Burning fossil fuels generates greenhouse gas emissions that act like a blanket wrapped around the air, trapping the sun's heat and raising temperatures. The main greenhouse gases that are causing climate change include carbon dioxide and methane. These come from using gasoline for driving a car or coal for heating a building, for example. Clearing land and cutting down forests can also release carbon dioxide. Agriculture, oil and gas operations are major sources of methane emissions. Energy, industry, transport, buildings, agriculture and land use are among the main sectors causing greenhouse gases. Humans are responsible for global warming Climate scientists have showed that humans are responsible for virtually all global heating over the last 200 years. Human activities like the ones mentioned above are causing greenhouse gases that are warming the world faster than at any time in at least the last 2,000 years. The average temperature of the Earth's surface is now about 1.1 degrees Celsius, warmer than it was in the late 1800s, before the Industrial Revolution, and warmer than at any time in the last 100,000 years. The last decade, 2011 to 2020, was the warmest on record, and each of the last four decades has been warmer than any previous decade since 1850. People are experiencing climate change in diverse ways Climate change can affect our health, ability to grow food, housing, safety and work. Some of us are already more vulnerable to climate impacts, such as people living in small island nations and other developing countries. Conditions like sea level rise and saltwater intrusion have advanced to the point where whole communities have had to relocate, and protracted droughts are putting people at risk of famine. In the future, the number of climate refugees is expected to rise. Every increase in global warming matters in a series of UN reports, thousands of scientists and government reviewers agreed that limiting global temperature rise to no more than 1.5 degrees Celsius would help us avoid the worst climate impacts and maintain a livable climate. Yet policies currently in place point to a 2.8 degrees Celsius temperature rise by the end of the century. The emissions that cause climate change come from every part of the world and affect everyone, but some countries produce much more than others. The seven biggest emitters alone accounted for about half of all global greenhouse gas emissions in 2020.